Let me tell you why you're here. You're here because you know something. What you know you can't explain, but you feel it. It's probably actually the opposite for interactions, right? You can explain it, but it's hard to get a feel for what it actually means. And we have this interaction here. What's true for all the different lines? Well, it's going upward. And then low, medium, high. I like how they're in order, low, medium, high. They're not always in order, and it's confusing if not. But okay, I think I can explain this. I'm going to start by pointing out the upward trend, which is always true. But now I have to explain the effect of stock. And I have a nice explanation for why more payload means more enemy deaths. But now stock, okay, as stock gets higher, the slope is steeper. There's a point in the middle where they're the same, and below that point, low stock is better. Above this point, high stock is better. Uh, can I think of a reason why? Okay, I gotta admit, explaining why the stock market affects enemy deaths, that, that, that's hard, but you know, I said something about how higher stock market gets people excited and they're distracted on this end, but they work hard and can't afford to be distracted on that end. Whatever, as long as I've shown an attempt to explain what's going on here, there's going to be my bonus point. Next, we have the media effect. I, I wonder if I could put this one on the actual data. Oh, I, I, I kind of like how you can see the curve in the data, and I'm clearly fitting the curve. The interaction, though, is super hard to see. I, you know what, I'm going to do it this way, just so that I can be doing it different ways all over the place in this report. I mean, part of my goal is just to show you the versatility that can be done, and also it makes it harder for you to just copy what I do because I'm so inconsistent. Uh, this is actually media suppression. I'm going to change this X link. A lot of students mistake this for amount of media coverage, which is kind of the opposite, and I understand why they do that. I usually don't dock points off for that because I think that's a really easy mistake to make. Okay, I'm going to start by talking about how this is the low point, and it goes up on either end. Just that part. We haven't even talked about the interaction piece yet, but just that part. How do I explain why 30% media suppression has the lowest enemy death? You can tell how I obviously have tons of combat training, because I'm making up all this stuff about how um, zero media suppression they feel intimidated, and 100% media suppression they're blind, and so there, there's why there's a curve. I, I just I want that bonus point, right? So I'm going to give it a chance. Now the interaction, and fortunately, it's really subtle. Like, so subtle, I have to go to this plot so that I can see the difference to even try to talk about it. And it looks to me like they all kind of line up here at 100%. It's only here at the 0% that I can even see how the lines are different. I'm sure the generals would be like, this, this doesn't even make sense, but... Um, when the media suppression is very low, then higher stock market is better. Why? Because they're more intimidated by ever by all our money. Now, even if this was wrong, the generals would be like, no, no, that doesn't make sense. And then they would start thinking of ideas that would explain this. So there is value to it. There's also value for me as a student because I'm thinking about what this graph actually means. And I'm going to put a little note on here that the stock market effect is so subtle that it's not really worth paying a lot of attention to it. Sadly, I believe stock market is the last one we have, and we actually have two plots to go along with stock market, and each of them is going to be a little bit difficult to explain, even though I just said we probably don't want to spend a lot of time explaining stock. I forgot to tell them, look at the plot below. Obviously, as that helps. Oh, uh, this picture is not going to be very fun. What's the other one? This one's at least a little interesting. Like, I can see how changing payload actually changes the effect of stock, at least somewhat. It occurred to me as I'm telling the generals the effect of stock is so subtle that it's even hard to control the stock market at all. So, uh, I'm going to spend a lot of work on this and it's not super valuable. Okay, so I decided to describe this one first because it's more interesting, like stock causes deaths to go down, and over here stock causes deaths to go up. Um, for the media effect, boy, super subtle. It does look like for high media, the line got a little more flat. I mean, I've got my nose pressed up to the screen. I can see that it's actually still upward, but only slightly. 
whereas the blue and red lines down here are more increased. So, okay, media suppression is high, the effect is slightly diminished. Am I going to try to get a bonus point here and explain these? Oh, gee. Okay, so good news, I already spent some time trying to come up with this explanation. So stock based off payload is because either they're distracted or excited, and then the media suppression is because they need it to get information. Okay, whatever. The fact that I explained this before when we did the payload graph or the media graph does not mean I get the bonus points for stock unless I explain it again from the stock's viewpoint. So there we go. That's how I got that paragraph out.